What looks like a sculpture is actually the world's first designer energy-saving light bulb. It's called Plumen 001. It looks different from different perspectives. It's the brainchild of two Londoners, Nicholas Roop and Samuel Wilkinson. There's so much activity around uh, lampshades and lampstands and fittings and fixtures, even switches. You know, there's a hundred beautiful switches you can buy. Uh, and then we looked at the, the light bulb itself and, and there seemed to be no innovation or, or no real sort of aesthetic inquiry. It's all very functional, all very, all very much about you know, energy saving and then what's the cheapest form that we can create. So it was in a, in a way, in, the, in, a, in a world that's actually, you know, has a lot of designers very, very occupied sort of thinking about how to do really nice things. The light bulb itself was really neglected. So we thought, well, that's a pretty good place to, to, to focus. The humble light bulb's design has long since become a recognized classic to which its energy-saving cousin bears no resemblance at all. So it's no wonder the designers use the original as a starting point. It's a very difficult thing to, to, to try and do because the light bulb is so synonymous, its shape is so classic and um, trying to come up with something new was quite daunting at first. But I think as we got into it, we, we found that we could push the manufacturing to try and create something a little bit with a bit of joy, with a bit of excitement. The Plumen 001 is on display here in the Design Museum in London. Last month, it was given the Brit Insurance Design Award. And the Museum of Modern Art in New York now features the light in its permanent collection. I think it's, it's very early to say whether Plumen is a design classic or will become a design classic. Um, I think of design classics, I think of the idea of an archetype and something that um, when you shut your eyes and imagine a product, that's the product that jumps into your head. And um, I think previously we've all thought of lighting and we have thought of the Edison light bulb. But for energy saving lighting, I think the Plumens are a very good kind of front runner for the idea of an archetype for energy saving lighting. The classic light bulb has inspired countless designers and artists over the years. German lighting designer Ingo Maurer has come back to the form time and time again, giving it a prominent place in his designs. As has German artist Karsten Hüller with his wall of light bulbs. London designer Tim Fishlock's chandelier is made entirely of light bulbs, as is this creation by the Dutch artist Roddy Graumans. There is something sort of almost perverse sometimes about trying to tackle the, the absolute building blocks. You know, redesign the brick, or uh, you know, um, you know, redesign water or something like that. It's like that. You know, we consider those things to be elemental, to, to be the, the kind of the building blocks, and therefore somehow sacred. But obviously, the, 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 the opportunity for us was to actually, at this moment, yeah, there is an opportunity to do it. There is a there is a, a moment when we we not only we can, but actually there's a real benefit in in, in, in rethinking and re, re, reshaping that, that 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 basic building block. Product designer Samuel Wilkinson worked on development for three years with the London design company Holger. The challenge was to transfer their aesthetic standards to something as complex as the energy-saving bulb. The Plumen 001 uses a mere 11 watts of electricity to equal the 60 watts of a traditional light bulb. You know, the biggest problem was that we'd never worked in lighting or in low energy light bulb manufacture before, so we had to learn everything from scratch. And, but it was also an advantage for us in many ways because it meant that we had a very open approach to it and we believed that anything was possible. The Plumen 001 is already in use in places like this cafe in London. At a cost of 30 euros, the bulb's distinctive design alone could render the lampshade obsolete. The name is a combination of plume, a bird's fancy outer feathers, with lumen, the unit used to measure light. Um, I've never seen anything like it before, so they're quite cool. Are they slightly different, or is it just the angle I'm looking at it? Very uh, um, fluid, dramatic. <laughs> I like them, yeah, yeah, they're very good. For Samuel Wilkinson, it's a chance to observe his work from another perspective. Oh, it's really exciting. It? I mean, that, that's the, the nicest thing about doing product design in a way that if you can stumble upon your own design unexpectedly is, is fantastic. The Plumen 001, putting the art into artificial light. <laughs>